Unlike administration senators, opposition senator Nancy Binai grills Abad on why the Aquino government resorted to the controversial spending program. She wonders why the executive did not simply ask Congress to fund its priority projects. Nakakatakot ho kasi Secretary Abad. Nagiging discretion nyo ngayon kung kailan nyo sila bibigyan at hindi. B9 zeroes in on the fund transfers the executive branch made to the Commission on Audit, or COA, and the Commission on Elections, or COMELEC, which the Supreme Court declared unconstitutional. She says the fiscal independence of constitutional bodies is hijacked by DAP, adding that COMELEC Chairman Sixto Brillantes had to plead for the funds. Parang ganun yun nangyari. Eh, di ba ho, kaya nga ho, nag, na may provision din sa, constitu, sa constitution natin na kailangan may fiscal autonomy yung mga constitutional bodies para ho magkaroon ng independence. E eh, di lumalabas ho ngayon, ang laki ng utang, ng loob, utang na loob sa inyo ng COA kasi nadagdagan ng pondo ang kanilang ahensya. Sino naman ang sisisihin ng taong bayan? Malamang hindi yung COMELEC eh. Malamang ang executive. Kasi sasabihin ng taong bayan, may pera kayo, hindi pa ninyo tinulungan. Binay says, quote, there is no foresight when it comes to planning and budgeting. She also questions the move of the DOTC to withdraw projects after Congress approved funding. This includes the rehabilitation of the Ninoy Aquino International Airport Terminal 1, seaports, and lighthouses. Hindi ko alam kung nakakaikot kayo sa mga airport natin. Uh, nakakahiya yung mga restrooms natin. And you withdraw itong proyekto na to for that. Well, no, we need...